changed my look a lot. I think that I'm into the more natural skin. I wear a lot less, but I've accomplished the same snatched look. Kylie Jenner has reached her breaking point with the constant scrutiny of her appearance and the hurtful comments labeling her as unattractive. Determined to confront her detractors head-on, she recently spoke out in an interview with the New York Times addressing the ongoing controversy surrounding her, though notably steering clear of any discussion related to Timothy McCallum. Amid swirling rumors suggesting trouble in her relationship, particularly with McCallum, and facing additional online criticism from her ex-partner and father of her child, Travis Scott, Kylie has chosen to tackle the issue head-on. This all comes amidst widespread criticism following Kylie's unveiling of her new look during Paris Fashion Week, where her appearance sparked intense debate across social media platforms. Even plastic surgeons joined the conversation, creating videos critiquing the perceived flaws in her altered appearance. After weeks of keeping the rumors at bay, Kylie Jenner has finally decided to set the record straight in a captivating video interview with the New York Times. While she didn't directly address the swirling gossip surrounding her appearance, Kylie delved into the evolution of her personal style, a topic that has divided opinions among her fans. Opening up about her journey as a mother, Kylie shared how her approach to beauty has transformed, gradually veering away from the lavish wigs and dramatic makeup that once defined her signature look. She confessed to relinquishing her former routine of immediately engaging with social media upon waking, signaling a newfound sense of prioritization and self-reflection. Intriguingly, Kylie attributed these changes to her growth and maturity and sophistication over time, distancing herself from the image of her past self. Yet amidst her transformation, Kylie acknowledged that not everyone has embraced her evolving persona, a reality she's keenly aware of. Reflecting on her early exposure to fame and the relentless scrutiny that came with it, Kylie candidly shared how she navigated the pressures of being thrust into the spotlight at a young age, constantly evolving her public persona to meet the demands of millions of followers. But in 2020, she decided to show the world her true personality and ended up receiving a lot of hate for showing who she was. Love her or not, let's face the truth about Kylie Jenner's journey with judgment and criticism regarding her appearance. While it's unfair to solely blame her for the scrutiny she faces, it's undeniable that she played a part in fueling the narrative. For years, Kylie vehemently denied undergoing any cosmetic enhancements, insisting that her beauty was purely natural. Who can forget the infamous lip saga? Kylie adamantly claimed her luscious lips were merely the result of expert makeup application, even launching her own lip kit in 2015 promising fans they could achieve her look with ease. However, as time unveiled, the reality was quite different. It became evident that Kylie had indeed opted for lip fillers, contradicting her previous assertions. This discrepancy between perception and reality has inevitably cast a shadow over her image. Despite her initial denials, the truth eventually surfaced, leaving many to question the authenticity of her brand. From the rise of the Kylie lip kit to the revelation of her cosmetic procedures, Kylie's journey has been marked by twists and turns, shaping her public perception in ways she may not have anticipated. Whether it's a tale of self-expression or societal pressure, one thing remains clear. Kylie's image has been both her triumph and her trial. Let's not overlook the fact that Kylie Jenner bravely confessed to struggling with insecurities, which ultimately prompted her decision to undergo lip fillers. However, when she mustered the courage to share her vulnerabilities with the world, the response wasn't as supportive as she hoped. This instance sheds light on the harsh reality of internet culture and the criticism Kylie faced. Her recent revelation about her inner struggles and the subsequent backlash she encountered during Paris Fashion Week can perhaps be viewed as interconnected. It seems Kylie's authenticity clashed with certain expectations resulting in a wave of negative attention. This candid insight offers a glimpse into the complexities of fame and self-discovery in the modern age. In a significant shift, Kylie Jenner's style evolution began to take shape around the time she debuted her striking lion's head look. Interestingly, this transformation coincided with a deeply personal chapter in her life, the months following the birth of her son. Kylie candidly shared her battle with postpartum depression, revealing how she grappled with feeling disconnected from herself during that period. Navigating through this emotional journey, Kylie eventually found her footing again, only to realize that the fashion landscape had shifted in her absence. 
It was during this time that she embraced a newfound sense of maturity and simplicity in her aesthetic, marking a departure from her previous glamorous persona. Coinciding with this evolution was her association with Timothy, sparking endless speculation about the catalyst behind Kylie's transformation. Was it merely coincidental timing or did Timothy play a significant role in shaping her new identity? Despite the swirling rumors, Kylie remained tight-lipped about their relationship, noticeably uncomfortable when the subject was broached during her interview with the New York Times. For those who follow Kylie and Timothy's relationship with fervor, recent rumors might raise some concern, especially amidst speculation about their alleged rocky romance. Whispers of trouble in paradise emerged when reports surfaced of Kylie imposing strict guidelines on Timothy. It's said that life became quite challenging for Timothy during the filming of Do, due in part to Kylie's purported demands. These demands stem from Kylie's past relationship traumas, particularly regarding infidelity. Fearful of history repeating itself, Kylie allegedly laid down stringent rules for Timothy, including cutting off all communication with his exes, even those considered friends. Any accidental interaction with an ex was to be swiftly reported to Kylie. But it didn't end their report suggests that Kylie also requested access to all of Timothy's social media accounts and required him to share his whereabouts with her around the clock. According to a source close to Timothy, it seems as though he's under Kylie's enchantment, obediently following her every command. These revelations paint a picture of a relationship marked by intense scrutiny and control, leaving fans wondering about the true dynamics between the pair. Kylie's concerns extend beyond just infidelity. She's also wary of Timothy potentially leveraging their relationship for personal gain. Consequently, she's issued strict directives. Timothy is forbidden from mentioning Kylie in interviews and prohibited from sharing any photos of them together until she deems fit. Sources reveal that Kylie left Timothy with no room for negotiation, asserting that if he wants to remain in her life, he must adhere to her standards, no matter how unconventional they may seem. Navigating through Kylie's extensive list of dos and don'ts undoubtedly poses a challenge for Timothy. However, the situation escalated to another level of speculation, particularly surrounding this year's Oscars. It's been noticeable that Kylie and Timothy haven't been spotted together publicly for about three months now, and Kylie's social media activity has notably shifted. Then, on March 5th, Kylie uploaded a video showcasing her morning routine as a single mother. Almost immediately, rumors began swirling, suggesting that Kylie might be subtly hinting at a breakup. Now speculation is rife that Kylie's next move involves meticulously erasing any trace of Timothy from her social media profiles, signaling a potential unraveling of their relationship. Upon stumbling upon these rumors, I conducted a bit of investigation and discovered an interesting detail. Kylie doesn't follow Timothy on Instagram or Twitter. However, she still maintains a connection with her ex, Travis Scott, on Twitter. Fueling speculation further, Kylie made a solo appearance at the Vanity Fair Oscars after party, prompting many to speculate that the couple may have indeed parted ways. Just take a look at these comments from people who have been apparently connecting the dots that Kylie has been leaving behind. Nobody believes this relationship. They do not make a good couple. He looks too young for her. Timothy Shiloh may never confirm he has a girlfriend, period. Kylie thought this relationship would make Travis jealous, and it didn't even work. He's Jenner. Kardashians need to give it a break. Not one of them have a healthy relationship other than Courtney. It didn't make sense and seemed like a publicity stunt. They even dated. Love him. But I've always been disgusted with the Kardashian-Jenner family. They seem to destroy every man they touch. Lol. So I'm glad if it's true they broke up. He can do so much better than that dumpster fire of a relationship and where that inevitably leads. Finally, this fake relationship between Timothy and Kylie is over, yay. Timothy must have gotten tired of all the rules that she set for him. All those insecurity rules that he cannot be around female co-workers and friends who are females. She's got to be serious for setting all those rules up. She had a lot of security issues and probably still does, and maybe that's why Travis loved her. She needs to learn to let go of all her insecurity if she ever wants to have a real relationship. In regards to Kylie's ex-partner, Travis Scott, tensions between the two seem to be simmering. Known for her entrepreneurial spirit, which has propelled her to billionaire status, Kylie recently unveiled her latest business venture, a fruity-flavored vodka soda named Sprinter. 
Interestingly, this announcement stirred up some intrigue as Travis also happens to own a vodka soda brand called Cacti. It appears that Travis may not be entirely thrilled about Kylie venturing into a similar market, setting the stage for potential business competition between the former couple. Sprinter is my answer to the growing consumer demand for quality canned cocktails. We're adding to a market dominated by only a few players with an incredibly delicious vodka soda in a can. Following Kylie's announcement of her new product, Travis appeared to express his discontent by sharing a picture of his own drink on Instagram with the caption, nothing better y'all. This subtle move hinted at potential tension between the former couple, adding another layer to their already complex relationship dynamics. The strain between Kylie and Travis has been evident, especially since Kylie's involvement with Timothy. Travis even referenced this in his song, Meltdown, where he seemingly sidelined Timothy. Further stirring the pot, Travis appeared to throw more shade in his track, Back Rooms, earlier this year, with lyrics many interpreted as directed at Kylie. In the song, Travis suggested that Kylie was using certain methods to alter her appearance, implying she was striving to become someone new. Amidst the backdrop of breakup rumors, plastic surgery speculations, and ex-partner drama, Kylie has emphasized her commitment to shielding her children from the negativity and scrutiny of the internet. Reports indicate a significant decrease in Kylie's posts featuring her children, despite the fact that such content typically garners the highest engagement. This shift underscores Kylie's prioritization of her children's well-being amidst the chaos of public scrutiny. What are your thoughts on Kylie's response? She seemed to sidestep the specific rumors about her appearance at Paris Fashion Week, instead addressing the broader criticism she's faced regarding her looks. But what about her reluctance to discuss Timothy and their absence from public appearances together? Is it simply a matter of privacy regarding their relationship, or could there be deeper issues at play behind the scenes? Feel free to share your opinions in the comments section below, and be sure to catch up on my previous videos for all the latest updates. Until next time, goodbye!